So now, sit yourself on the end of the couch like I was. So you're going to come to the end. Rollo, come here. Yep. Yep. Now, where is your posture? Yeah, that's your best correction. <clears throat> so now, you're going to bring that belly forward. So bring your feet back a little bit. Yeah. Bring the belly forward to your head and keep going forward until you start to feel the bum coming up. Yeah. Now, drive the hips forward. Yeah, and all the way up. Oh, that's lovely. Now have a seat again. So hands on your lap. Bottom is out. Nice and tall, but look at the plop down. Okay, so do it one more time. Posture first. Nope. Posture first. So lift your tailbone. So your belly should be forward now. Lifting up. Good. Now bend over and stick your bottom out, but keep your back straight. Yeah. Now slowly lower. And what you find is right at the end you just flop into the chair. You need I this time I want you to very gently touch your bottom onto the couch, okay? So try it again. Bring your hips out. Yep. Yep. Now when you sit, I want you to imagine that you don't know whether that seat is hot or not. So you have to just very gently touch it to make sure it isn't too hot. Okay, your head's too far back. Nope, your head has to be way out past your knees, so bring your head down further. Bring your head all the way down to your knees. But get bend the, you gotta bend the knees. Now, that was much better. So if you can keep the head out past the knees, okay, then you can control the quads and the core. But if you start to get your head back too far, you're just going to fall into the chair because you have no leverage. Your core has no leverage, okay?